December 26th, millions of Americans will bring celebrate will begin celebrating Kwanzaa, a holiday less than 50 years old. A new documentary narrated by Maya Angelou looks at the importance of Kwanzaa. So what is Kwanzaa? Educate me. I don't know anything, hardly anything about my culture. You know what Kwanzaa is? Yes, it's Christmas. I think it's a Jewish holiday or something like that. Kwanzaa is like renewing your annual membership to community, to your family, to your culture, and most importantly, to yourself. These are principles of what we're supposed to be doing 365, you know what I mean, and how we treat each other, and how we look at the world. We did not petition or ask for permission to celebrate. We did it by Kuji Jakuli, a self-determination. We determined that this was good for us. We determined that we were going to celebrate. That's just a little bit of The Black Candle, a documentary directed by M.K. Asante Jr. M.K., good morning to you. Good morning. And Thank happy you for Kwanzaa. Happy Kwanzaa. You know what? Of course, we know what Kwanzaa is. It's been around for 40 years, but a lot of people still don't understand it. Yes. So give us the basic primer of what is Kwanzaa. Well, you know, Kwanzaa is an African American and Pan African cultural holiday that celebrates the African experience all over the world. It's celebrated by millions of people and it's centered around the seven principles or the and Guzu Saba, which are unity, self-determination, collective work and responsibility, cooperative economics, purpose, creativity, and faith. Okay. And it's, it's celebrated using some uh, sim uh, symbolism, if you will, so symbology. We have a table here, a Kwanzaa table set up. Definitely. Take us around the table and tell me what we have and what it means. Well, you know, Kwanzaa means first fruits. So we have the fruit, the harvest, that represents, you know, the harvest and, and the Kwanzaa celebration. And then we have the Kanara, which is the candle holder. And we and this holds the, the seven candles, which represent the seven principles. The red candles represent the struggle. The green candles represent the hope and prosperity that come from that struggle. Mm -hmm. And the black candle, of course, represents the African-American experience and and that's why we named the film the black candle because it was more than a film about a holiday it was a celebration of a people mm -hmm. and then we have the unity cup and then we also have the Zawidi or the gifts so all, every uh, day during Kwanzaa different gifts are given that usually have an educational uh, value to them so we have you know um, the black candle for us it really is a neat uh, holiday and it's not just for those of the African descent it has value for all cultures yeah I mean when you look of Kwanzaa, those principles are universal, you know? And so there's so many people that can embrace uh, those principles all around the world. M.K. Asante Jr., thank you very much. Happy Kwanzaa to thank you. Thank you so much. Happy Kwanzaa. If you'd like more information, you can go to our website, cbsnews.com.